we're talking about kindness this week and I encourage you to share these videos with anyone who you think needs some encouragement. It would be helpful. And in Ruth chapter 2, verse 2, Ruth and Naomi are together and they don't have much. They've just endured a famine. And Ruth says to Naomi, let me go out into the fields and I'll pick up whatever leftover grain there is and anyone's eyes who, you know, show me favor, I'll pick up their leftover grain. And what I want to highlight here in terms of kindness is that Ruth is willing to serve Naomi. She's willing to be the one who goes out into the fields and picking up leftover grain was, you know, pretty low in that culture. And it was also a risky endeavor for a single woman to be out there in the fields. At that time, uh, she might be risking her life. People could take advantage of her and people could mistreat her. And so she didn't have protection around her, but she risked, she served, and she cared about uh, her mother-in-law, Naomi. So serve your in-laws, uh, that, that's one application, but be kind. Be kind to people in need. Be kind to people who don't have anything. Serve them. If you're at a low point in life, it's so key. Continue to serve. Continue to serve when you feel like, uh, you know, there just isn't much. Not much hope and not much opportunity. Continue to serve other people. Serve them well. Risk. Be willing to do the job that no one else wants to do. Just know that God sees you. He sees that. He sees your kindness. And God's going to bring kindness to Ruth because God never misses it when someone's kind to someone else. And so continue to have hope, continue to serve, trust the Lord. He sees your kindness.